So, hello, Jackie. Well, hello, Alice. <laughs> I guess it must be Tuesday again. It's Tower of Tuesday. It is Tower of Tuesday. I actually really enjoy saying that. I'm having a lot more fun with it than I thought I would. So, <laughs> <laughs> like the TTs, yeah. <laughs> I'm on Tuesday. Well, it's like let's talk. It's Tower of Tuesday. Ah, <laughs> oh, that's awesome. How was your How has your week been since the last Tuesday? So I got to tell you, today was like 15 degrees. That was a milestone that brought me a lot of joy. So, yeah, I think the past week has brought a lot of joy and stuff. I was pulling stuff out of my garden last week, which made me really happy. <laughs> think it's about landscaping. Early. It's too early for gardens. No, it's but it's early. just... You, you got to get ready and you got to plan and you got to do all the stuff. So I, do. Um, I must say I am doing that. I have seedlings in the house, which are not doing well because I planted them too soon, but I just had to do something that looked like planting and that was it. So, yeah, no, um, I think Alan was supposed to join us. Maybe he's doing his artist thing, I guess. So. I guess. So I had an idea yeah. um, about some of the things that we could do on Torah Tuesdays. Uh, moving forward. And one of them I did share with you, but I wanted to throw it on the table for the folks who are watching as well. Yeah. Um, anybody who knows the folks from Bring On The Sunshine know that we are really strong on Ubuntu, uh, which is the, the spirit of community or connectedness. And now we feel connected to Tuchawana. So that is a very good Ubuntu feeling. Late to the party, but he gets there, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> so I was just sharing with the folks um about how we we had an idea about launching a monthly award the ubuntu spirit awards uh and i know you have some strong thoughts about ubuntu maybe you would like to uh riff a little bit on that <laughs> yeah Ooh. you have limited time you can't riff all night just putting that out there <laughs> there's no history here there's like no history there's nothing to see <laughs> as i wanted to know like how, how how liberal am i supposed to be in just going off on this to give us the very short version <laughs> well uh ubuntu it it matters very much that we understand the concept it matters very much that we actually expound the what it means to, to live the ideal of Ubuntu. That's the, the acknowledgement of humanity that exists in us. Now, I've heard Ubuntu thrown around in many different contexts where it's supposed to fit a, an agenda or it, it's not that, it's just what it is, it's humanity. If it's not about humans connecting and seeing each other for being human, Please don't use Ubuntu. <laughs> it yeah, so it can't yeah. be about connecting with plants. <laughs> is no. Sorry. I'm just saying, like, it, it's that bastardization of what is. If you are going to look at something and say, we want to uh, absorb this, acknowledge this, and use this as part of us, then it has to be used in full context of what it is. It cannot be adapted to the, oh, I want it to mean this. Oh, hell, but you know, that's not what it is. <laughs> Thank you. Well, and that's yeah. the that's the appropriation versus appreciation, right? To appreciate, you really are immersing yourself in the context around the thing, whereas yeah. the appropriation is, oh, I like this. I'm gonna stick it on my jacket. Yeah, yeah, and make it look fashionable. It's like, uh, mm -hmm. okay, fashionable is cool. There's nothing wrong with beauty and stuff, but beauty with acknowledgement of the reality mm -hmm. that exists around what you're trying to put across. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so my idea was our idea was that we would ask you guys who were watching uh, and also we will explore among our contexts um who in our community is demonstrating the spirit of ubuntu because although it is a very african um southern african southern african like, phrase framework understanding of how to be in the world. We know that there's many people out there who live this without ascribing the word Ubuntu to it. And so we would like to recognize uh, the people in our community who are doing this. So they don't have to be black. They don't have to be African. It's awesome if they are. Um, <laughs> but yeah, we want to give you a shout out. So let us know if you know somebody out in your community who is really demonstrating 
the spirit of Ubuntu, demonstrating like beautiful humanity in relationship to other humans. Yep, that's we would that's my know what they're doing, so we can talk about it and exactly. then we can yeah, encourage. Absolutely. Yeah, and maybe they'd like to jump on on the Facebook Live and come say hi to you guys. So, yeah, no, maybe. we always we always want to say hi to people. Mm-hmm. But so what I wanted to talk well, about today, yeah. well, I, I feel like I've had this uh, love-hate relationship uh, this week with the Derek Chauvin trial. So I wanted to hear what you guys, where you guys are at, because I'm like, I don't want to talk about it, but I feel like I have to talk about it, but I don't want to, but I do, but I do. Anyway, so I'll let you guys First share all, your I'm very absolute opinion. First of all, absolutely, thank you for saying Derek Chauvin trial. I am so glad you tired of hearing people saying George Floyd trial. George Floyd is not in trial. He's already dead. You already <laughs> got killed. And the, the whole idea of George Floyd trial, like, what did he do now? It's he can't do anything from the grave. Yeah. It's like, if you're talking about this dude, it's, 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 it's like he is, he's on show. Uh-uh. Is the guy who knelt on him, Derek Chauvin trial. I've seen it so many yeah. places. I just like, oh, come on, come on. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Jackie, how, what were you, what have you been feeling or any, if anything? Um, like truthfully, I think I just feel very jaded and I don't really want to watch in case I get really disappointed. Yeah. So, yeah. Yeah. yeah, that's really the feeling that I'm coming with. Like, you've just seen it go wrong so many times. <laughs> yeah. yeah. You know, the thought that keeps coming to my head is is this thought of, like, you know, we went through this last year where it was absolutely, it hurt every Black person to the bone, right? Where it feels like picking on a fresh wound again. Mm-hmm. Where it's like, I, like, I'm glad he's on trial, but it feels like we're, you know, we're being asked to, you know, to emotionally react, to relive that experience all over again. Like mm-hmm. it was really hard to watch the video the first time. I tried to resist it, but anyway, so it just, yeah. So I don't know. It's like the trial is necessary, but the emotions that it brings. Like, what would you like to see happen? Like, what would feel like satisfying and healing, really? Oh. That is a great question. I think, I think what's really hard, if, especially if you're following, is to see, like you know, we obviously, ha- like for me, when I looked at that video, there's no, there's no arguing, there's no debate, but to continuously watch the debate about it, that you know, people, this is, there's actually a conversation. Is there really though? Like, really? Mm-hmm. You know, so it's back to that space where as a black person, you're feeling like, oh, so now we need to explain this again. Like, you know, so I don't know if it's it's necessarily about the outcome, but it's the process of being taken through it all over again and being having to justify that. No, it was actually wrong. Yeah, it just feels. And, you know, I guess it kind of makes you think like most most people in this situation when you know when it happens and it's your family member they probably go through that because trials mm-hmm. are prolonged and stuff like that but this is just more on a mass scale so i don't know alan did, what what are you, what are you thinking <laughs> or oh, feeling uh, if anything <laughs> besides you know, besides the not calling it george floyd <laughs> yeah. Uh, you know, I, I think just that, that comment alone shows that how very sensitive I am to what's yeah. going on. Because, again, no matter how people may perceive it, this this could have been me. Yeah. Like, easily. I'm a black man, just like Floyd. Big, just like Floyd. And could have easily been in the same position that he was in. And then now, to oh, it sit. could have been your son, right? Yeah, and then now <laughs> to speak and listen to people argue semantics, argue yeah. things that don't actually change the, what truly happened. I mean, we also it it just speaks to 
what has been going on for so long and they've been hidden. So, you know, in one way, the trial just says for anyone who had any doubts about how the system is kind of mm-hmm. operated, there, yeah. right there in front of you to see. You can see it, mm-hmm. right? You've got a witness who's telling what they saw. And they called the police. Hey, hey, I see I'm not a police killing a guy. And then they're trying to make it seem like he's an angry guy or he's got a problem. So I say, uh-uh, I'm not the one who nails on the guy. I'm not the one yeah. who why do, I, why do Why should I sound like I'm angry for you doing something that is nasty? Mm. It, it, it's a good time right now. And yeah. um, no, no, not to trivialize what's going on with George Floyd, but I, I think it was for me. And then I go and, and read that our police service decided to make. Oh, beautiful. Oh, yeah. rainbow <laughs> the timing was terrible. What? Right. Rainbow? What? No, not rainbow. Like diverse. They. I don't know if they just the painted the cruiser, the police cruisers in Kitchener Waterloo, by the way. So, oh. so it's like, yeah, in the midst of us, you know, being uh, drawn back to the emotions of uh, 2020, mm-hmm. they are uh, they spent money on this cruiser uh, to cruisers, cruisers, which is supposed right. to promote diversity, but we're still hurting from the fact that they didn't reduce their budget so now they're telling us what they're spending their budget on so go and paint police cars a different color so that apparently that's supposed to make us feel more comfortable around police cars like bloody (laughs) seriously like really okay (laughs) grab on some paint and you're still gonna come out with your damn gun pulled out and i'm gonna be okay oh look at the colors of the car nice (laughs) <laughs> maybe maybe it's a way so that they're in disguise. So when they park like on the uh, you know on the zebra crossings, what do they call them here? Pedestrian crossing. Yeah, I'll be like, oh look, is this the pedestrian crossing? It's not an actual police car. <laughs> I, I I can't believe they actually sat down and decided to spend money on that, and they actually had the money to spend on that. It's wow, like, whoa, yeah, wow. You wonder yeah. how much? Like wrapping, like painting cars is expensive. Because I know I've looked at it, it's expensive. Like, what what would that be in community dollars, right? How far would that go in community dollars? I don't think I, I, uh, talking about those numbers will make us feel any better. No, but I, <laughs> but I, I know some, the- some organizations who are doing actual work in the community who could use even a five thousand buck throw down so they can do some work. I mean, five thousand like how oh, call it? That's the watch too paint and put all the little gadgets and stuff on them mm. and we turn that to social services to actually working where it's needed but now yeah. let's go paint police cruisers and make people <laughs> feel comfortable so, i guess we sound we sound really angry and emotional today <laughs> I, I must say though i don't, uh, yeah. I don't no, think no 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 i don't subscribe to that we are not angry or not emotional we're just like yeah, we're just talking. I don't know how to explain that. Yeah. Talking, right? This is how we deal with it. We talk about it and then we move on. <laughs> I don't I don't think you were the audience though for the painted police cars. I don't think you were the audience. So who is the audience? Not black yeah, people. Because I'm the then one what's the point? Who- Right, I'm the one who's reacting badly to this. this, this so, yeah, this so thing. I guess that's a good question, Jackie. Who is who's reacting well to it then? Mm-hmm. Who is loving yeah. that the police cruisers in Kitchener Waterloo are now painted to promote diversity? The police are. Oh, well. <laughs> they sat down and thought it was a good idea. Yeah. <laughs> Okay. Yeah. <laughs> no. It, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I I don't know if they asked somebody who might look like me and be like, "Hey, would you feel better if we painted the car different?" Ah. <laughs> next, <laughs> next, time, <laughs> next time, I'm I'm willing. Just call me. And I'll no. Be like, not. Would you feel? You know, and it goes to say a lot of the times when you know when we talk about diversity or how to be. Uh, sensitive to the environment around you, 
you actually have to pay attention to what's going on in the environment. Because like we said, this was bad timing because the Derek Chauvin trial is happening. And so the black community is obviously feeling that. And we just, you know, we're still trying to deal with that the budget wasn't cut. They got an increase, budget increase. Huh. So, you know, the temperature in the room is, is not geared towards us accepting this 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 gesture mm. in a very positive light so you know i think you always have to be before you take the action look scan the environment yeah read the room <laughs> read the, the room get get tank like cars because apparently we are about to go to war in the city and then we're gonna paint them nice <laughs> <laughs> You know, yeah, it's funny because in Zimbabwe they had like tech like cars, but they didn't bother painting them. Yeah, they, because no, they didn't make them user friendly. No, <laughs> yeah, it's actually <laughs> funny because uh, you know, like I remember my dad probably wouldn't thank me for saying this, but uh, I remember him saying, you know, that like the same situations will like unfold in Africa as in the West, yeah. you know, so the same like uh, corruption or wrongdoing or whatever. But in the West, like there's a, a subtlety mm -hmm. about it yeah. that, so that people like, you know, they can dodge like wherever the, the holes are yeah. and whatever. Whereas in like in Africa, the spade is a spade. You Why? How can you say it's not? It's a spade. <laughs> Everyone yeah, knows. Yeah. At, at, at home, it's corruption. And here <laughs> you're just playing politics, right? Yeah. It's, <laughs> it's just a different name for the same uh, beast type of so. <laughs> <laughs> it's, just un, un, it's just unbelievable. For me, it's just unbelievable that it's it's okay to to have such kind of spending. I don't even want to call them just like such kind of freedom oh, to yeah. spend in that manner and no accountability, mm -hmm. literally, because it's it's taxpayer money we've paid into it, oh. and we 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 cry out for social services we cry out for more money towards groups that can actually help we cry out for mental health money and stuff yeah. but no we're going to put it to the police and then we're going to let the police paint cars and make people feel nice when the cars are painted and that is going to help mental stress i mean i see police and they're coming after me i'm going to I, I, i'm still trying to make the body i'm i'm totally distressed <laughs> oh, I see we can car. see it we can see it so did anything is, is there anything positive that has happened over the last week before we end this this 20 hours 20 minute session <laughs> tell us about your planting <laughs> you know your planting brings you joy <laughs> uh oh one thing uh, positive did happen so i uh, thank you uh the avocado tree that we've got in the greenhouse is looking amazing so oh, oh that's one really thing. oh yeah it's growing the leaves are growing so big now i'm just thinking who i'm going to eat avocados and then it okay to me i got four years to go four years to yeah go. i was gonna say they don't uh yeah it doesn't happen that fast so no in four in four years time we'll bring you back here and ask how the avocados are maybe you will share them Oh yeah, so, I'm, I'm hearing a thing. I'll, I'll put it on 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 our social media. Say hey, no. check out this tree. Look at it now. Look at it. But once you start making avocados, I don't know nobody. Y'all don't know. <laughs> <laughs> you tell us. We can find you. <laughs> yeah. Well, and you forget. Remember, Africa Day may be at at the farm, so we'll know where it's at at that point. Oh yeah. So. That, yeah, you, you, you can't run away. So because this year we're actually going to do something to commemorate Africa Day, which is on the May 2 4 weekend. So stay tuned yeah. for that. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> stay tuned for May 2 4. We're gonna have a party. It's Africa Day. That means the coming together of African countries, organization of African unity, it was called. Now we call it the African Union. Just celebrating the coming together of Africans, you know, just yeah. So we want to bring it over here have fun with it just not invited for the avocados 
<laughs> yeah, there's no running. No, I mean, no. put it in my calendar for what is it, 2025? <laughs> <laughs> Check out avocados. It's, 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 it's the African way. You you don't have a choice but to share, whether you want to or not. Yeah, this is it's you so just talking to yourself and sharing. It is Ubuntu, <laughs> my brother. <laughs> That's perfect. Okay. So, yeah. All right. Okay. You're welcome to the avocados. I think this is going to be a proponent of Ubuntu and then deny you guys avocados at the same time. That's the problem with family. They know all your weak points. They do. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, it has been great. And those of you who are watching, please reach out to us. Tell us what you want, to, want us to talk about with our crazy selves. And just a disclaimer, when we're laughing, it doesn't mean that the topic isn't serious. It's just, no. this is how we process. This is how we stay positive. This is how we stay, you know, above the tide that is, or the mm -hmm. environment that we're living in. So you know, it, when we're laughing, I, I'm saying, Alice, you're right. You know what I mean? When we're laughing, it's like those times where people have got tears just going down their faces, but they're so happy, so much joy, right? <laughs> It's the same thing. Sometimes we laugh outrageously loudly and crazily because yeah. the opposite is to break down completely yeah. and calm. So, yeah, that's just it's a better way. way. It's our way, yeah. anyway. Our way. <laughs> Jackie, yeah. any final thoughts before we lock off? You know what? No. <laughs> <laughs> what <happened? laughs> that's fine. <laughs> That's fine. <laughs> no, I just realized, like, Alan and I were getting all this airtime, so I thought, no, maybe Jackie's sitting quietly and thinking, I should have said this, so. No, well, you know, like, it's a heavy topic, and I often feel like, you know, my I'm, I'm the white person in the room. Like, my role is kind of really to listen, and, you know, like, I'm representing all the white people right now. But you're still one of us anyway, so. Our family knows no color, so. <laughs> yeah. Well, I appreciate yeah. that. Thank you. <laughs> All right. Well, thank you, everyone, for staying tuned with us, and we'll see you next oh, guys, Tuesday. Guys, Is, did did anybody write a comment on Facebook right now? Who's 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 looking? No, not today. Don't funny. worry. I'm I'm gonna tag some folks on this, yeah. so yeah. we'll see what happens. Like, <laughs> All right. yeah, we, 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 we'll keep going. Soon, soon enough, we'll have a big audience, and we'll be talking and talking. All right. Thank you, everyone. Have a good evening. Thanks, Tuesday. Guys. Bye bye.